everyone welcome back to my channel it's Trish if you guys are new thanks for watching and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and if not welcome back to my channel today I wanted to film this pretty glittery look it's like an icy blue um, glitter I don't know I just I picked up the glitter and I you know wanted to do something with it so that's what I went for so um, everything I use will be listed down in the description box do not forget to thumbs up this video like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next one. The first palette I'm going to be using is the Morphe 35K palette, and I'm taking this brown shade, and I'm going to be using it as my transition. The next transition shade I'm going to be using is from the Morphe 39A palette, and it's a shade called Vivid. It's more orange, and I'm just using that to warm up my transition a little bit more. Then I'm going to be going to the Morphe 35B palette and I'm taking this light blue shade and I'm putting this in the outer portions of my crease. And then y'all are going to see me go into my BH Cosmetics palette, the 120 edition, the 122nd edition palette. I'm going to be taking the three different blues and I'm going to be just putting that in my outer V as well. Like each shade that I'm taking, like they're all like a little bit darker. So I'm just using, as I'm like darkening up my crease, those are the shades that I'm using to actually darken up my outer V area. And now I'm just going back into that 39A palette again, and I'm taking Indigo, and I'm just gonna use that to to darken up my crease even more. Now I'm going back into the 35K palette and I'm taking this gold shade and I'm using that as my brow bone highlight. Now I'm taking my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Porcelain and I'm going to go ahead and cut my crease. I'm not gonna cut my crease all the way. The way I'm kind of cutting my crease is like I'm cutting it, but I'm leaving some of that outer area out so like the shadows can blend into each other. I don't know if that makes sense, but y'all gonna see what I'm talking about. Now I'm just taking this shade called Taylor from the 39A palette and I'm just going to put that all over the white concealer that I have placed down. Now I'm taking my NYX matte liquid liner and I'm going to go ahead and line my lid. Now I'm taking my NYX glitter primer and this pretty glitter from Super Glitter it's called Sea Eyes. You guys, I had to do like a look using this glitter because this glitter is really pretty. It's like an icy blue shade and I just had to do a look using it so that's what I'm using. So I went ahead and completed the eyes off camera. I also went ahead and did my face, like my base off camera. I used my Maybelline foundation and my Wet n Wild Photo Focus primer. Now I'm just highlighting my face with my Kat Von D Lash Concealer in the color D35 Neutral. And I'm just gonna blend it out using my beauty blender.
Now I'm just gonna contour my face with my Elego Pro Concealer in the color Mahogany. Now I'm going to be setting my highlighted areas with my Tasha Buttercup powder. And I like to press the powder in with like a wedge and then I take a brush and I dust it away. I don't like to bake too long because when I bake too long, my skin look a little too dry underneath my eyes. So I just like to dust it away immediately after I pat it in. Now I'm taking my Maybelline Fit Me Loose from powder in the color dark and I'm just going to set my face with that. Now I'm taking my sleek contour kit in the color dark and I'm going to set my contoured areas with that as well. Now I'm just taking my same face powder and I'm just gonna go ahead and bake underneath my contour because we want our contour to be snatched. Now I'm just going back over my brows with my ABH Dip Brow in the color Ebony. Now I'm taking this silver shade from the Morphe 35K palette and I'm just going to pop that in my inner tip. Now I'm taking um, Vivid again for the 39A palette and I'm going to smush that out on my lower lash line. Now I'm just dusting away my powder. I also went ahead and applied my mascara and my e.l.f. jawliner off camera. Now I'm taking my NYX blush in the color Bordeaux and I'm just going to be putting that on the apples on my cheeks. Now I'm taking my NYX dewy setting spray and I'm just going to set my face with that. And the highlight I'm going to be using is the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighter. I don't know the name of it, but I will show y'all in the video, as y'all can see here. Now for my lip combo, I'm going to be using this... I forgot which lip liner this is. I, it's a new lip liner that I picked up from my local gift supply store. And the lipstick I'm using is the Nikka K Matte Liquid Lipstick in the color, I think it's Dune. I'm not sure what color it is, but I will make sure to put it down in the description box. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Everything I use will be listed down in the description box. Do not forget to thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next one.